right, welcome back. Now, the ambivalence of Kenya's policy and lawmakers on biotechnology is indicative of diverse pressures bearing on them to take some stands with regard to GMOs or biotech crops. According to Professor Crispus Kiamba, the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Higher Education, Science and Technology, Kenya will eventually have to adopt genetically modified food technologies to feed its growing population no matter how long it takes. Dr. Clive James is a founder and the board chair of International Service for Acquisition of Agribiotic Applications, ISA, and he's here to tell us more on the benefits of GMOs or biotech crops, as you call it. Good to have you. Thank you very much. Right. What time uh, uh, did you wake up today to come for this show? I know it, mu uh, it must have been pretty About early. About 5.30. 5.30? Yes. Great. Yeah. Good to see you. Good, good to be up in the morning. Right.